Today on Brian's Train Room, we're talking about dealer displays. Not the big old dealer displays, but ones that are a little bit more reasonable, like a counter display like this, the D101 from 1953. The Lionel D101 was made available to dealers in 1953. It was shown with details about the display in the dealer display catalog available earlier that year. It was available for $49 net cost and included nearly $75 of accessories attached to the display to help with sales. According to distributor paperwork included with the dealer display catalog, the D101s were set to be built and delivered by June of 1953. When ordered, the D101 was shipped with some parts mounted and some additional accessories included. O-gauge and O27-gauge track and switches, as well as the milk and cattle platform were attached. Shipped with the display was a 450 signal bridge, 153 block signal, 252 crossing gate, 151 semaphore, 445 operating switch tower, a 145 signal, 71 lamp, post, and 262 barrel loader. The display measures 23 inches square and is 21 inches high. The display is made from lightweight plywood. It is painted white and has, a, has Lionel emblazoned across the top and bottom in red. Dealer displays such as the D101 were considered countertop displays and were a great option for dealers who had limited floor space but needed to show the latest offering of accessories needed for buyers to complement their new train set purchase. These counter displays were popular with smaller retailers who could spare some counter space but were not able to fit a 4x8 or 8x8 running layout. Showing some of the latest accessories in action would help move more inventory and increase profits. Plus, at the end of the season, the attached accessories could be removed from the display and sold. The D101 was a popular display because it was action-packed and very compact, but most were dismantled at the end of the season. Therefore, a complete and original display is hard to find. The D101 from 1953 would make a great addition to any collection. All right, guys, that's my video. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more of it, hey, like and subscribe. I'd appreciate that. Also, want your feedback. So down below, great place to add that. Let me know how I'm doing and ways I can do these videos better. I don't do this alone. So I have lots of help from friends and fellow collectors. And there's some names at the end of the guys who've helped me really make these better and share their collections that I can share with you. So appreciate it. Thanks for joining me on Brian's Train Room.